So, welcome to this week's Guzzling Gourmet. My little GGs, get it? My little Guzzling Gourmets. Um, before we start, because today's meal is a bit different to the last two, today's meal is all a bit quick. Oh, before I forget, before I forget. This one, we'll need to keep the warm. So, I need to put the oven on. So, I'm going to put the oven on. I'm going to put it about 100 ish. All right, we don't want to cook it, just keep it warm. It's one of these dishes that really doesn't go down well at pies. Well, it does, they like it, but it's sort of like you really want to cook it and eat it. So when you cook it for loads of people, you end up having to put some in the oven keep warm. So that's what we're going to do. So, let me just adjust that down. Um, we watched Catherine uh, Jenkins, I almost called the cooks again, Catherine Jenkins. Uh, but because the wife was running late, because she was working too much, uh, we ended up not eating before seven, because seven o'clock we had our Zoom session with our friends. Um, we ended up, um, well, getting me cooking now, late. So I thought we'd we'll start with a beer tonight. I haven't really had one. That's, it's just dirty glass, dirty glass, I haven't had one. So, I thought I'd introduce you to this one, Black Isle Brewing Company uh, Porter. Now, I've been, I've got a favourite, and that's coming up in a bit. I'll show you that one in a bit. This one, second favourite Porter. No, third favourite. Sorry, third favourite. The second favourite I can't get anymore. Well, they haven't brewed any for a while, but hopefully, um, it tends to be a little bit on the gassy side, so you get a big head on it before someone says, I can't pour a bloody pint. Look at it, well, ain't a pint for start anyway, is it? So, this is quite nice, it's sort of licorice Right, so tonight's meal is a Mexican, so really we ought to be drinking lager, and we probably will later with the meal but I thought we'd start with our porter. Anyway, tonight's meal is Mexican, like I say, quesadillas. Now I might have pronounced that wrong. I did ask an expert in, well, Portuguese, not really Spanish, but Portuguese or Mexican or whatever. Um, and she told me, I'm sure that's how she said she pronounced it. I say, this will be a blue, blah, blah, a blue corn tortilla. Okay. They are actually made from a variety of corn that is blue. Right? So it will be blue corn tortillas. And as I said earlier in the week when I announced what we're doing, this is a vegetarian meal. Now, it's not strictly speaking vegetarian, uh, vegan, sorry. But if you want to substitute cheeses for a vegan cheese, then you could make it vegan, but there's no meat in this. Now, sometimes when we, we have that, excuse me, when we have a dinner party and we've got the vegetarians there, I sometimes whip up something with a bit of steak or something with it. as like a side dish with it for those people who like their meat. Right, so, blue corn, and cheese quesadillas coming up. 